Well, right now we'd usually be in the midst of the MLB season, right? Obviously that's not the case. Instead, the season is on hold while the league determines the best and safest way to move forward. And I want to bring in CBS Bay Area, Dennis O'Donnell, for his thoughts on, on just the proposed season options that they have right now. Because Dennis, right now it's looking at like maybe an 82 game schedule moving forward. What are your thoughts on that? I can't believe it. Two months ago, I was at uh, spring training covering both the Giants and A's. And now two months removed from that, still no baseball, still no from plans to play baseball. An issue regarding revenue, which is not going to come out uh, nicely at the end of the game. But as far as 82 games, Katie, I'm totally good with that. I see uh, the NHL strike shortened season, which I was good with. It means more emphasis on winning games uh, because of the shortened season, but I'm totally good. I think 82 games is actually a great barometer for whether it, a team is a playoff team or not. 162 games is a long, long season. I'm good with 82. And at least we'll finally get to see some baseball. Now, I want to ask you, Dennis, how do you think that this shortened season is going to affect the Giants and the A's? Do you think it's going to help them? Do you think it's going to hurt them? Well, two more playoff teams in each league, a total of 14 uh, uh, playoff teams. For the Giants, that's only good news. Uh, Katie, this is a rebuilding year for the Giants, a new manager, second-year vice president, uh, a roster turnover, uh, question marks all over the field. If you're adding two playoff teams to the mix, that's only good uh, news for teams in the rebuilding mode like the Giants are right now. As far as the A's goes, um, I think the A's issue is uh, to get to the next level. They can make the playoffs or a good team. They have to get beyond that wild card game. They have to win the division outright and get to the uh, American League Championship Series. At least, I feel it's a uh, boom or bust for the A's in that regard. And Dennis, right now, that's probably going to be a little bit of back and forth before we actually do see any baseball. But hey, I think we're all going to be excited to see a little bit of action moving forward if they do go ahead with that 82 game schedule and the extended postseason, of course. Dennis, thank you so much for joining me today. I appreciate your thoughts. For even more MLB news, and if and when the season starts up, you can check all that out over on CBS San Francisco's website. Katie Johnston for CBS Local Sports.